Are you interested in digital planning, but you're not really sure what it is or which one is right for you? If so, then keep on watching because I'm going to explain to you what digital planning is, why you should start digital planning if you haven't already, how to choose the best digital planner for you, and then I'll show you how you can actually get started today completely free to see if it's right for you. Okay, so what is digital planning? First of all, digital planners are not apps. They are essentially planner PDF templates that you'd use in a PDF editing app, more commonly known as like note-taking apps. So some examples of this are like GoodNotes or Notability, KiloNote, um, and so forth. So you use these apps so that you can actually write in the planner, you can add photos, you can add text. Essentially, you're just editing them. So you're adding all these things on top of the planner template itself. So the planners themselves are hyperlinked, meaning you can click on different links within the planner and they'll take you to that specific section of the planner. A common question we get is, can your planner work on blank device or blank app? Our planner files are the same no matter which device or app you use. So as long as you have a device and an app that allows you to edit PDF files and activate hyperlinks, you should be good to go. Of course, you will be limited to the capabilities of your specific device um, and the app of your choice. Again, just make sure to stick to the end of this video um, so you can actually test out for free um, our free sample planner on your specific device or app. I mean, as for us, personally, we found that the best digital planning experience comes from using an iPad, um, an Apple Pencil, and the app GoodNotes. But really, do your own research, figure out, you know, what works for you. Okay, so why start digital planning? Digital planning is perfect for anyone who needs more flexibility in their life, because unlike with paper planning, digital planning easily allows you to erase to edit. Um, you can move tasks and events around. Unlike with planning apps, digital planning can feel a lot more organic in that you can just brain dump and draw, you can add photos. I mean, a big reason that I made the switch from paper to digital planning was how much it simplified my planning process though. A lot of our lives can get pretty chaotic and stressful and I hated the idea of using a planner only to find myself spending more unnecessary time and energy trying to organize my life, rewriting the same tasks over and over again. Now I can really streamline the process of planning with things like copying and pasting reoccurring tasks or events in my life. I can save these sort of templates of my own so I don't have to spend time coming up with ways to decorate my planner. This is actually how I plan my days, so just a few clicks and I've decorated it and I've already added in tasks that I have to do. If you're more on the creative side, now you have unlimited access to photos from the internet and an endless amount of pen and highlighter colors to add to your planner without having to buy an endless amount of pens and highlighters. I just started making memory keeping and journaling a thing for me and it's been an incredible creative outlet for me and a way for me to actually remember what I do throughout the week. Cause I don't know about you, but I always have my phone on me so I can easily just take a photo on my phone and add it straight into my planner. Okay, now here is why Passion Planner Digital is the best digital planner of 2024 though. Our design is very user-friendly and intuitive to use. It's set up very similarly to our paper planner, which makes it more intuitive. So you have tabs on the bottom and the sides of your planners that take you to specific sections of the planner. It's laid out like this. So in all of our planners, you have a passion roadmap to help you plan your short and your long-term goals. This helps you break down your goals into small, achievable, manageable tasks that you can actually implement throughout your planner. I mean, that's what's great about Passion Planner is that we help you to live a more intentional life um, with this roadmap system because you can actually like add in these steps throughout your planner so that you won't just goal set and forget. You've got a yearly overview, you have reflection pages to fill at the end of each month. You've got monthly layouts. And then depending on which planner of ours you choose, you're either going to have weekly layouts where you get a whole weekly overview that's set up like this. Or you've got daily layouts where each day is split up into two separate pages. You have one side um, where you can kind of structure out your day and you have to-do lists for that day and then you have a whole blank page for you to fill up however you choose. At the end of the planner, you've got blank pages, you have dotted pages, and then you have grid pages. 
And these are for you to duplicate and insert wherever you want into your planner and use as many times as you'd like. You also have index pages where you can add in pages and organize them as needed. So you pretty much have a whole extra notebook at the end of the planner. And then lastly, you have a favorite sticker page where you can add in all of your favorite stickers so that you can easily access them whenever you need them. All right, so this part I'm really excited for because this is new for all of our digital planners. We want you to have everything you need to get started with your digital planner. So with any of our digital planners that you choose to purchase, they now come with this theme sticker pack of three. So these are stickers that match with our three new colorways and they include icon stickers, washi tape stickers, time block stickers, and more. With any of our planner bundle purchases though, you get both these theme stickers and our functional sticker starter pack. And this is huge because you get so many stickers with this. So you get some of our more popular uh, functional tracker stickers. So you can keep track of your steps. You can keep track of your mood, the books that you're reading, the shows that you're watching, your expenses and more. You also get our inserts and worksheets. So again, you get habit trackers, movie trackers, expense trackers, you get travel packing lists and more. And then you have what makes our planner definitely one of a kind. So you also get our custom digital stickers. A big reason I specifically love digital planning is I can now customize my planner. So when I say like customize your planner, I mean like I can erase certain parts of my planner. I can add in things that are specific to my needs. Um, and you know, my needs change from day to day. And I love that my planner can also change from day to day, depending on what I need. For example, say your day doesn't start at these given times. Let's say your day starts early one day and then late another. I can just add in stickers so that my day starts at different times. Let's say maybe I don't need a work to-do list, but maybe I need a school one. I can just add in these stickers here to change that. This is what my planner usually looks like. I just click a couple clicks and I have this completely customized layout. Okay, so which planner is right for you? How do you choose the right planner? All right, so we have three planner types available for you to purchase. You have the weekly 2024 planner, the weekly undated, and the daily undated. So as I mentioned earlier, the weekly planners feature weekly layouts that look like this, and the daily layouts have layouts that look like this. The weekly 2024 planner is the dated one and has the dates already in it. So Again, how do you know which planner you should choose? If you need to see your full week schedule all at once, choose one of our weekly planners. If you really need to be able to break down your schedule each day, maybe you want space to brain dump or mind map, journal, then the daily planner is probably perfect for you. The daily planner is also great, let's say if you want to get into bullet journaling, but maybe you need a little bit more structure so the daily planner would be perfect for that because you have the structure on the left side of the planner and a whole blank page on the right to bullet journal. Do you want the freedom to be able to pick up your planner and use as needed without the pressure of having to use it every single day? Well then choose either the weekly undated planner or the daily undated. Once you've figured out which type of planner you want, if you go on our website, you'll notice there are two different options for each planner type. So there's gonna be the elite black version or the planner bundle version. If you purchase the elite black version, you'll receive this one planner colorway. It looks like this. It's not just the cover, it's the tabs inside as well that have this color scheme all throughout the planner. So it comes with both the Sunday and the Monday start version. And as I mentioned a while ago, you get our free theme sticker pack of three with this planner choice. This comes both in the PNG versions for all of you non GoodNotes users to use, and then the GoodNotes elements collection file type or you can actually import this directly into the GoodNotes Elements tool. So if you want something like simple, sleek, and you just need this one colorway, then this choice would be perfect for you. If you purchase the planner bundle, you receive all four colorways, all with their own matching tabs. So you have the Elite Black, Alpine Lake, Haven Hills, and Rainbow Prisma. You get, of course, the Sunday and Monday starts of each of these planners, and you get our free theme sticker pack of three, but also our huge functional sticker starter pack that I showed you earlier with all of the stickers. If you want to start planning for free today, 
say you're like all right this sounds really cool i still want to like try it out though i'm not sure if it's right for me and i don't want to make you know a purchase today go ahead and click the link in our description to download our free sample planner in the sample planner you get our intro pages you get a passion roadmap a yearly overview one monthly reflection page one monthly layout and two weekly layouts and only these tabs are going to be hyperlinked since it's just a sample planner and you have links just to these layouts that are featured here you also receive a free sticker sheet as well if you want a tutorial on how to download your sample planner we will have a link to that in the description as well all right so that is our video on how to choose the best digital planner for 2024 we always have huge sales so make sure to click the link in our description to sign up for our newsletter where you'll get notified whenever those are happening and happy planning. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them in a comment below.